All right, I figured I'd put this video together. Uh, I did a bunch of research. I used to own a Kodiak Canvas six and a half foot truck tent. This is the eight footer. I couldn't find anyone who really did much on them. It's my fourth gen Ram. As I said, eight foot bed, crew cab configuration. It's an eight foot Kodiak Canvas tent. Now, this is the second time I've set it up. This is more of a dry run, uh, simply because I wanted to see what it looked like with the disco bed bunks in it. You can kind of see them there. Um, couple things to think about obviously uh, sorry for the sun angle there obviously there's quite a bit to uh, consider when you're looking at what works for you what doesn't um, me and a couple of my buddies like to get out and be in spaces that are a little more remote so this works well for us um, but I'd like to really get my daughter out with me a couple times so here's what the setup looks like with a uh, Camo Cot XL in it, so you kind of get a sense of the two. Um, some quick measurements. There's plenty of room up top. Uh, I'm six foot seven. I fit on these bunks, no problem. Um, I probably wouldn't want it much wider. Uh, we got a dog that comes with us, so he can be there uh, or even here on the end uh, near the tailgate. But to give you guys a couple ideas and measurement, uh, to the bottom of this tube here, it's about 10 inches. There are roughly 20 inches between the two bunks, more than enough to crawl in and crawl out of. And there's, I think, a little more than 25, 27 inches from this tube to the top center of the tent. So lots and lots of room. These things perform really well, at least in the situations that I've been in with them. Uh, they do well against rain. They do well against uh, light snow loads. Um, the screens do well against bugs as long as you make sure you fill all your gaps uh, along the side I'll show you one of those in a minute. There are two gear pockets, but my tonneau is rolled up up there makes them relatively Non-usable uh, not a big deal to me, but gives me plenty of room Should be nice for us. These things are pretty lightweight uh, Obviously the bunks are about the heaviest part of the setup But if you're looking to get out do a little more remote camping all good uh, one of the only things I would suggest for those of you who are Considering it, I had a third gen Ram. The tailgates on the fourth gens are so light that you can actually, I don't know, you can kind of see that move there. But uh, maybe put something heavy back there just to maintain the tension on your tent. Uh, it doesn't make a huge difference. As I mentioned before, biggest thing you got to consider is just making sure you fill all your gaps. So, this as an example, um, I'd make sure that this was pulled a little tighter. I might even use some magnets or something uh, just to take care of that. But pretty easy to set up. Uh, really really like these tents. It's done a really nice job for me uh, May not fit everybody's needs. You know, obviously there's no hot water or shower or toilet or anything um, But they'll go anywhere the truck will go again. Sorry for the Sun um, We've had a good time in ours in the, the shorter version This longer version is only gonna be better if you got any questions hit like put them in the comments and uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I can